Greetings, Souls Wind here, and welcome to Let's Play Shapes IO. In this episode, let's start with this one. Can we convert this to a permanent fixture? So this is what I need, and these two need to be combined. No. And this is what I don't need. I'll rotate this. We have a combination over here, a stacking over here to have like these two. Okay. Then these two are being stacked after one of these rotations to give me like the opposite parts. Like you can see here, these are the two opposite ends. So the production will be this and I need to cut this away on the middle so that this and this separates and then this part gets discarded. This remains and then this is combined with this. So what you see on the output is this one. We can just have a court painter now. Like that. And that's it. This will be our new supply. So this will be replaced by the new design. Meanwhile, this can continue supplying. It's okay. Now, I'll put this in here. So this goes into here, the supply goes in here. The other supply, instead of the white going here, it's this supply going here instead. Look, here. See? Now this goes in here. The white dye goes in from the other side. Go to the E and then, no, not E, but okay, never mind, whatever. Put this here, put this here. And then remove the wires, put the wires here and here, and then press one and one and we're done. Now that's supposed to work. Heh. Okay. Good enough. Okay. With this said and done, do we want to create our own white color supply? Just because, you know, when we level up, we will have different random shapes that are requested. Instead of building the color supply for those, we should keep these color factory colors for them. We don't need this anymore. So we have a lot of space now. Okay, so we managed to get some optimizations. Not a lot. Next, what I need to submit is this one. And this one is pretty crazy. So we need red and white. So red and white and green star. So I think we'll go with this. We can use this region because all the colors are correct, but we may have to rebuild everything because this is not right. So we got to delete. This location is fine though. White. Put it further by one. So this is like that. So it goes one here and then goes down the rest. Good. So this goes in here. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Put it here. Good. Okay, so then red color comes over here. Okay, like this. And then so we need to decide which is white and which is not white. What I'll do is I'll pull one of the white supplies. Let's take this one. 20,000 in here. Good enough. And we need to know which ones are the right ones. Huh. So these are the right ones. That's it. And we can finally upgrade that. Wow. 
I'll set up the entire factory, meet you back here in just a bit. Wonderful. We are supplying this finally, albeit at a slow pace, but we are supplying it. So the next thing we need to do is to optimize. I'm gonna cut forward again. And then subsequently 60,000. Not very good. So I'll get this ready off recording. Next episode, this will be ready for upgrades. Okay, just a bit of add-on because this supply is really very slow. I can extend this supply, send some of those resources across this line using tunnels, and then continue supplying. So I can still extend this a little further. So now we are supplying about 55,000, almost 60,000 as compared to the previous 34, much better use of time. Thank you so much for staying and watching until now. I really should end this episode. That's all I have for now, have a nice day.